In this tutorial, I'll show you how to model and render lipsticks. Let's use a cube. We need to shift select the side edges and control B to bevel with mouse wheel up. I'll align the mesh's bottom with the world center and move the origin to the 3D cursor. S to scale. Let's select the top face and type G and Z to move on the Z axis. E to extrude. Let's auto smooth to fix the normal issues. Let's use a cylinder. Control R to place a loop cut and the mouse wheel up to add more loop cuts. Select the top face and I as in India to extrude inward. E to extrude downward. Let's remove the last two, since we need to apply more materials to the mesh. Control 3 to subdivide, G and Z to move on the Z axis, S and Z to scale in the Z axis. We need to have a boolean mesh. Let's use a cube.
Time to add the materials to the rest of the meshes. Let's create a second set of lipstick meshes by using a cylinder.
Let's set up the render scene. I'll select and extrude the back edge like this. The lights will bounce better this way. I'll add an additional light source by using a plane with the emission shader. Shift, D, to duplicate. R, to rotate. Let's add a point light. We need to remove the shadows from the point lights.
Let's experiment with the ground mesh's material. This is good, but we need more details on the ground. I'll add the noise texture node as usual. I'll use 32 samples to render. This is the end of the tutorial. Please like and subscribe if you have enjoyed watching this tutorial. Thank you for watching.